While talking to journalists yesterday, the Metropolitan Hospital CEO Kanyenje Gakombe said that the hospital accelerated plans to produce its own oxygen after supplies were squeezed to the limit during the height of the third wave fanned by the variants of the coronavirus first detected in Britain and South Africa. In April, Kenya registered a record of 571 deaths and the health ministry warned hospitals were overrun with fewer than 300 patients in the intensive care unit and fewer than 2,000 hospitalized countrywide. According to Davis Mareka, director of O2 International, the Kenyan company that installed the machines, the plant takes in atmospheric air and separates the oxygen from all the other components. The hospital also built a piping system that delivers oxygen directly to its rooms rather than using cylinders, which are also scarce.